Food Network's Anne Burrell loves to share her chef's secrets on how to make amazing food. So I had to indulge myself and make her oatmeal cream cheese butterscotch bars. Then I thought, how could I do this decadent bar justice and turn it into a cocktail? What I came up with is something I call the butterscotch bliss. So I start with a shaker filled with ice. And I'm gonna add three quarters of an ounce of Irish cream. It's gonna give it that rich, creamy goodness. Then I add three quarters of an ounce of butterscotch liqueur. That will help that butterscotch flavor really stand out. Then I'm gonna add a half an ounce of anise liqueur, which is a licorice liqueur. Okay, dip that in. Half an ounce of cinnamon schnapps. And then for the creaminess, I'm gonna add a half an ounce of half and half. Now this is indulgent. Okay, then I'm gonna zest in some fresh lemon peel. Now this is gonna give it a nice bright flavor without curdling my cream. And start giving it a good shake. So before I pour this into my cocktail glass, I'm gonna rim the glass with raw sugar. Dip it in some water here, okay, into the raw sugar. And this is gonna give it a nice crystallized crunch with every sip. Take off the lid and pour it in. Then I'm gonna top it off with a little pinch of cinnamon. Now I'm ready to indulge. Mmm. You've got a little bite of crystallized sugar, which plays off the cinnamon, and then you have the butterscotch. This is like an adult milkshake. This is so decadent and smooth and buttery and silky. Wow, that is so good. <laughs>